Yeah, send in uh, my expedition, please. Thank you. seen a neurologist all right and then he just wants you to wants me to just administer a full cranial nerve exam yeah that makes sense all right let me just call you up here and uh yeah we have a cranial net exert yeah cranial nerve exam chart here track things because you will have to come back in about six months three months maybe depending how the results are today but we're going to just go over your senses you know taste sight hearing touch smell I'm just going to feel around your neck area and head as well yeah basic stuff Have you been getting headaches since it happened, the accident? Yeah. That's why, yeah. Yeah, neurologist is the first person you're going to want to see on that. But, uh... I'm going to be going back to them next week. All right. All right, well, let's get started. The, uh... First, we're going to do taste and uh, smell first. Uh, First two. First, we're going to do smell. Very simple. I just want you to close your eyes. I'm going to hold these little uh, containers up to your nose. Take a nice whiff in and tell me what you smell. All right? All right, close your eyes, please. Yeah, take a nice whiff. What do you smell? All right, that's right. Lemon. <clears throat> Alright. Now here comes the second one. Same thing. Okay, close your eyes, please. Big whiff. What's that smell? Yeah, that is garlic. That is a bit overpowering. That's usually the easiest one. <laughs> Even if you're having trouble... With your sense of smell, people smell that. All right, and the third one. Close your eyes again. What's that? Orange peels, that is right. All right, good on the smell. That's a good point. Three smells isn't going to, you know, completely heal. You're in the clear. Your smell is fine now. Keep an eye on all of these things, though. If certain things, like if, you, if say, someone in your house is cooking chili or something that has a good odor to it, if you can't smell that, you know, call somebody. Or at least keep an eye on it. And if you, like, can't smell certain things or whatever, definitely get in contact with me or your neurologist. All right. All right, so second is uh, taste. But before that, I want to do a little memory thing as well here. I'm going to uh, quickly just tell you three words. I do this in every one. And then later on, I just want you to repeat them. So kind of just remember, kind of a remembering thing. All right. All right, you ready? All right, the, the words are baseball, birthday, and point. Baseball birthday point baseball birthday point all right all right now to taste is a simple one you got a little liquid here 
similar smell. I just want you to take a swig of this. Now it's going to, there's going to be kind of two, this is pretty advanced stuff actually. There's going to be two tastes in here. The first one you're going to feel and maybe like five seconds later you're going to taste like almost like an aftertaste. That's going to be the second thing, all right? All right. There you go. All right. What's the first thing you taste? Apple, that's right. Yeah, just wait for it. Yep, orange. All right, good. Yeah, it's an interesting thing. I don't know. It's like time released. It's weird. All right, taste is good. Here comes the... Uh, this is the longest part. It's the sight one. It's oh, in a lot of ways, it's the most important. They're all important, but this one's extremely important. Um, have you had any like vision issues since the accident? You sometimes get a little blurry vision. All right, that's something that could pass as well. You know, it's it's hasn't been long. That's why it takes time. These things, unfortunately. Head injuries take a good amount of time to, uh, you know, recover. Yeah. All right. Uh, let me, I just need to. Yeah, my eye chart it does not stay up on the wall anymore. That's fine. I just need you to move back a little bit. Perfect. Yeah, stand up. Yeah, against the wall there. Perfect. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm going to hold it. First things first. Actually, I'm sorry. I'm getting ahead of myself. Come back, yeah, come back. All right, first things first, I just want you to look forward at me. And do not... I mean, I could do this in either order, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, just look at me. Look straight ahead. Do not turn or move your, you know, your eyes. I just, I'm going to bring this in and just tell me when you see it each time, all right? When it comes into your line of sight, all right? All right, yeah, just look forward. All right, this side. Perfect. Okay. Now, same thing. Look forward. Don't move your head. I mean, yeah, well, don't tilt your head. But now, move your eyes and just follow this pen while I move it around. All right. You ready? Here we go. Good. Same thing, I just want you to close the one eye first. Yeah, I'm going to do the same thing. Just follow it with this eye. Actually, I'm sorry. Tell me when you see it leave your line of sight. All right. Cover the other eye. All right, perfect. All right. And I'm sorry. I'm a little off today. Yeah, all right. So this is going to be a little bright but uh, yeah just kind of look forward I just want to see how your eyes are dilating constricting yeah just look straight at me that's good yeah and the left is a little not reacting as quick make a note of that and this one is fine just make a quick note of that left eye not only listen don't good to be cautious and be concerned but don't bug yourself out all right now let's get to this part all right now go back to where you were all right same thing i'm gonna hold this up like this you're all the way back there stare straight both eyes open we're gonna start at one we're gonna see how far you go down all right all right here we go 
One. Yep. Three. Four. Five. Yep. Six. Good. Seven. Good. Eight. All right. Quickly, can you tell me this color? And this one. All right. Nine. Very good. Ten. Excellent. And eleven. Can you finish it? All right. Not bad. You missed a few there in eleven. That's fine. That's really good, though. Same thing. Let's close your room. Yeah, your right eye. Same thing. Start at the top. Just go down. You can just go down it. Yep. Perfect. Yep. Mm hmm. Uh huh. All right. So yeah, right eye is good. Now we're going to see if this, the left eye is good as well. Same thing. You close your right eye now. Here we go. Yep. Four is good. Five is good. Six is good. Hmm. You struggle a little bit there on seven. How about eight? can't really all right all right so there's some vision action in your because your eyes were always good so some vision action in the yeah all right let me just make a note all right yeah i'm gonna want you to see your uh, eye doctor preferably in like the next week They'll be able to give you more information on stuff and, and whatnot. And you're going back to your neurologist, so I'll send this information to him as well after we're done. Don't listen, don't concern yourself. You're doing actually pretty well so far. You know, for an accident like this. Okay. So your sight is solid. Um, you know, you struggle a little bit with your one eye, but that's fine. Okay. So we're gonna do touch. And then we'll do hearing. Um, first things first, let me just sanitize my hands here for you. I know, you like to do it, I mean, I'm clean. <laughs> oh, it smells rough. Just give me this, let me give it a second here to kind of dissip the smell to dissipate. All right. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna feel around just your neck, the back of your head, and tell me if you feel any pain. I'm trying to feel for any swelling, maybe bumps or anything like that. Do a few other little things. All right, so let me just feel around. No, this hurts. Feels good. Back of the head. No pain. That's good. Alright, I'm gonna put my hands on your shoulders, just shrug up and don't, you know, just push up against him. Alright, that's good. And just turn your head just side to side and then up and down. Yeah, just do side to side once, up and down once. There's no pain when you do that, no stiffness or anything. All right, that's good. <clears throat> All right. All right, that's good. Let me just quickly. All right, so now the second part of the touch test is I need you to close your eyes again. You can close them now. I'm going to feel around your face with this q-tip I'm holding 
I'm going to touch your forehead, your nose, cheeks, chin, and just tell me what I'm touching. All right. All right, here we go. Yeah, just keep, yeah, keep your eyes closed. Don't cheat. <laughs> what am I touching? Head. Yep. Cheek. Cheek. Chin. Yep, head. Cheek again. Other cheek. Alright, you can open your eyes, that's good. Alright, like I said, you're doing pretty well so far. Oh yeah, real quickly and to ask us now, what are the three words that I told you earlier? Well, yep, that's right. Birthday. Yeah. And point. All right, baseball birthday point. Excellent. Excellent. It's, I like to do that because it, it, you're you're focusing on things and you're remembering stuff. Sometimes people forget, you know, you get a little memory loss, short term memory loss or long term. When you suffer a, a kind of a traumatic head injury, so that is good. All right, so the last part we're going to do here is hearing. I'm going to go back and forth in each ear. Same thing, you have to close your eyes. You don't have to close them just yet. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to whisper numbers into each ear. I'm going to get a little lower as I go for, through with it. First, I'm going to do some sound. And I'm going to do it close to your ear. I'm going to pull away. I just want you to let me know when you don't hear it sound anymore and then i'll go to numbers i'll start kind of soft spoke and then move into a whisper all right ready all right so i'm gonna go by this ear first close your eyes and just i'm gonna make this sound and tell me when you don't hear it anymore all right here we go excellent and the sound Alright, now we're going to numbers. Alright. I'm just going to say, I'm, I'm not even going to tell you what ear I'm going to first. You'll obviously know. If you can't hear me, then something's up. Alright, here we go. Seven. Two. Five. Nine. Can you repeat those? Good. Three. Two. Eight. Four. Very good. I'm going to get it a little lower now. Ten. Four. One. Zero. Excellent. Fifteen. Twenty-five. Four. Six. Excellent. I'm going to get real low on this one, all right? Here we go. Good. Other side. Forty-one. Thirty-two. Nineteen. Seventeen. Excellent. Yeah, yeah, you can open your eyes. All right. All right. Let me update this real quick. Everything was good, except the one eye there. So you're gonna want to go to the eye doctor and. I'm going to send this over uh, Dr. Jones is your neurologist, right? Yeah. Yeah, I got all their emails on file. All the doctors. All right, so I'm going to send this over to them. Let me send it now. Attach. All right. And you're going to want to make an appointment on see your eye doctor yeah and like i said that's fine if it gets worse um i'm trying to think well if you get any if you're experiencing bad headaches obviously go to an er 
immediately, like anything terrible, because I know you haven't suffered from any headaches, so if you're getting bad, consistent ones, or you get a crazy one out of nowhere, absolutely go to the ER, no questions asked, don't even wait, all right, if your eyesight's getting worse, same thing, if it's going in and out, kind of a little blurry, you can wait, but get to it. Your eye doctor, neurologist, or me as soon as possible. It's like you can't see anything out of your eyes. Same thing. Get to the ER. You know, and if anything feels weird, if you know, if you're not feeling right, something wrong with going to the ER. I just always better safe than sorry. All right. Yeah. Absolutely. It was good to see you again. Uh, you don't. You need blood work. Oh, that yeah, was, oh yeah, that I could, I could wait, I guess, yeah, uh, make an appointment to see me up front and let's do three months, because the eye thing, and we'll, and we'll take blood that day too as well, sound alright? Yeah, man, absolutely, you know, if, you, if you're not comfortable with anything, you can also call as well, you can call me, call your nurse, call, you know? If you have a question or anything, you're not feeling right. Because, like I said, this is new for people. You know, you get into, you get bad head hurt injury. You want to know what's up, you know. And there's nothing strange has happened, right? All right. Besides the little vision, blurred vision, you said. Yeah, absolutely. Don't hesitate. Do not. When it comes to the head, do not hesitate. All right. Yeah. Like I said, make that appointment in three months. Um... I sent that over to your neurologist, and you'll be seeing them next week, you said. All right. All right, excellent, man. I'm starting to start to feel better. Yeah, have a good day, all right? You want some uh, hand sanitizer for the road? <laughs> there you go, yeah. All right. All right. I guess I should use some, too. Appointment.